shows the moment this SUV crashed right into this concrete pole. But it also captured the moments those good Samaritans rushed to help, ultimately saving lives. You can hear what sounds like tire screeching moments before impact. This blue Jaguar SUV slamming into a concrete light pole on Griffin Road near Anglers Avenue. The driver and two passengers that included a six-year-old girl still trapped inside. 20 seconds pass. The SUV goes up in flames. Still burning another 60 seconds before a driver stops to try and help. Eventually, a man arrives with a stepladder and tries to break open a window. He's unable to when another good Samaritan in a black shirt grabs the ladder, breaking the back window and opening the door, pulling out a 20-year-old woman and 6-year-old girl, saving their lives. The two pulled to safety as a nearby worker with a fire extinguisher tries to put out the flames. This chilling cell phone video recorded by a witness showing the vehicle engulfed in flames. As first responders arrived, the woman and little girl on the ground, knowing their loved one was unable to make it out, ultimately killed in the crash. According to BSO, the surviving victims were rushed to the hospital with severe burns and broken bones. While the crash forced the lanes of traffic to be shut down for hours, investigators are now trying to obtain more video from nearby businesses with hopes it can explain what caused that driver to lose control. And as we come back out live to that concrete pole, I can tell you I did get a chance to speak with that good Samaritan who rushed to try and help with that fire extinguisher. He tells me he's still very shaken by all of this and upset that they were unable to rescue everyone inside of that vehicle. Still heroes in my book. For now here in Dania Beach, Roy Ramos.